Now we welcome in John Rawlings, who has gotten to know Matt Country pretty well these last couple weeks. No doubt about that, Jason. This matchup follows the old saying, familiarity breeds contempt. St. Henry and Marion Local have more in common than just geography. Marion's head coach Tim Goodwin had good friend Brad Luthman on his staff in 2011 and 2012 before the top job came open at St. Henry. Of course, a strong bond developed between the two over the years. But tonight, that would have to be set aside. Familiar foes fight in our Spotlight Game of the Week. Football Friday Night Spotlight Game, presented by Owens Community College. And away we go. St. Henry traveling to Marion Local. The Skins trying to beat the Flyers for the first time since September 25th, 2009. In the third quarter, Flyers leading 21-7. One of the toughest seven-yard runs you'll ever see. Dwayne Liger's keeping it for himself. He's in the pile somewhere, and he comes out across the goal line. After the extra point, Flyers up 28-7. St. Henry trying to respond. Mitchell Stammen searching, but how about an old-fashioned tip drill? Cole Griesdorn comes up with it. He's tackled out of bounds. Flyers take advantage of the turnover as Neefield hits the circle button. He crosses the plane, and the Flyers now lead 35-7. St. Henry not laying down yet. Jesse Niekamp, patient runner, finds the hole, and he's headed into enemy territory. Down at the 30, but stuffed on a fourth and one. Marion Local tops St. Henry 42-7. Another history lesson in the MAC. In 11 tries, Anna has one victory against Coldwater. That win dating back to September 10, 2010. Scoreless in the first, Coldwater in the red zone. Bad snap off Hemmelgarn's hands. Nathan Poppleman jumps on the loose ball, and Anna forces a turnover. Rockets end up punting. Hemmelgarn has that quick quarterback memory. Forgetting the turnover, finding Craig Shane Hare for a first down. Moving the ball well. Next play, Hemmelgarn again rolling to his right, spreading the love, hooking up with Aaron Hollermert for another first down. The way this drive was going, you probably predicted seven for the Cavs. You'd be right. Hemmelgarn, quick strike to PD Post. Coldwater goes up 7-0 to finish the game on top, 40-7. Now let's go back to Eddie with more from the MAC. 